Welcome to Sitam Church Online. My name is Karita Mbagara. I'm the senior pastor at Sitam Valley Road. In the book of Matthew, chapter 16, when Jesus is asking his disciples, Who do you say that I am? And Peter says, You are the Messiah or the Son of God. Jesus speaks to Peter and tells him, This is not a revelation from the flesh. It has come from my Father. But he goes on to say, as we read in verse 19 of that chapter, I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven, and whatever you lose on earth will be loosed in heaven. And the question that I want to ask is this, what does it mean to bind, and what does it mean to lose? And what is it that we are to bind and what is it that we are to lose? My take is this, that we should bind the things that the devil is throwing at us against the will of God. For example, he may, he, he may try to throw a sickness or a disease towards a believer. I think we have the right to bind that and to refuse it and indeed to cast it away. We have been given the authority to bind all that is against the will of God. The devil may tempt us to go in a direction that is against the will of God. Even that, even when it appears like it's a good thing, we should ask the Lord to bind it, or we should bind it, and we believe that heaven will join us in binding that which is against the will of God. But in the same breath, we should lose everything that is ours that the devil is trying to take. Whenever the devil is trying to act as a hindrance, as a barrier to the blessing that is ours, we should lose those things so that they can come to, to us. God has certain gifts that he wants to give to the church, or to give us as individuals, we should lose them. We should lose the gifts of the Spirit. We should lose the, the healing of God to flow freely. We should uh, release the Word of God so that it can convict people. We should release even the blessing of God that the devil is trying to keep away from the people of God. I think that's what it means to bind and to lose so that we don't just bind everything blindly, we don't bind people, we don't bind, you know, anything and everything, and we don't lose anything and everything. We need to be discriminating in what we are binding and what we are losing. And I hope that this will help you as you pray and bind and lose. God wants us to do it in wisdom, and in this way, he will bless us. Have a great time. If this is instructive to you, please share it with a friend and invite them to join us at Sitam Church Online. Thank you very much and have a great time. Amen.